you don't have to go to the ends of the earth to see the impact mankind is having on natural habitats around the world. As NBC's Kerry Sanders reports, all you have to do is look at the oceans. On today's special episode, the who, what, when, why, where and how of the Pacific Trash Vortex. This is a sand dune made of plastic. This plastic sand is coming from all around the Pacific Rim, swirling into a vortex that eventually brings it to these shores. If you're a fish or a bird trying to determine what to eat, you've got a better chance of selecting something made out of plastic than you do real food. It's a huge soup of trash twice the size of Texas that has a dubious honor of being the biggest landfill on the planet. 90% of this trash is plastic, 80% which originates on land, and the other 20% comes from seafaring vessels. for this mess? Well, humans. Every piece of plastic we've ever made is still on the planet. It doesn't go away. Plastics should not be in the ocean. Patrick O'Connor, we're here to do a beach cleanup on Santa Monica Pier. It's a beautiful Thursday morning, in Los Angeles, California, the fifth of the fifth of April, and uh, we're here to clean the beach. What we got going on here? This is trash? The beach? It's ridiculous. Oh, cool, too. <laughs> Can't say for later. <laughs> <laughs> We're using. <laughs> we enjoying some scoops. With that ketchup we found in there. Yeah. Oh, I don't even want to know. Classic bottles. What are you picking up there, Colin? McDonald's straw and styrofoam residue. This is the leading cause of whale deaths in the United States. It's depressing. This is number three. Connor, are you thirsty? Another empty one. Where's all the trash going? On the beach. We're this close to the trash can, they can't even make it in. Well, I think uh, another thing I think they've been trying to do is get a little bit more uh, advertisements out there, and just you know, public advisory notices about how you know the storm drains that they all run in the ocean, things like that. So I think there's a little more public awareness. So that's one way to do it. Um, that's just, yeah, public, just public knowledge is getting to know the fact that anything they put in the street is going to end up in the ocean. Is it trash? Uh, yeah, most of the time. You do? Does it gross you out when you see trash on the beach? Sometimes it might step on it. Yeah, it makes you not want to come to the beach, right? Well, I would say that. 
Oh, makes me not want to come to the beach. What do you think is the biggest problem with beach pollution today? Mostly. Right here. How heavy are those? Got really heavy. 40 pounds together. Wow, that's a lot of trash on the beach, guys. It is. Most popular polluter right here, McDonald's. Next was food for hours. We got water bottles. Ketchup packets. And that. Got a ton of styrofoam, styrofoam cups. That's super bad, isn't it? Real bad. And a million cigarette butts. Dumpster. Throw it in here? Yeah. <laughs> 